Hey, look, it's the world's sexiest concert promoter. <laughs> it's Steve and Laura time. Let's go. Come on. Hey, Steve. Things are really coming together. Shanice's mm. concert is going to raise a lot of money for our scholarship fund. Mm. Yep. Say, mm. you look pants. Back rub. Black eye. Back up. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me they're not cute. He said, back rub. She said, black out, back off. Oh, gosh, I love them. Love them. So, my little daffy dilly. Mm -hmm. My birthday's this Saturday, and I'm going to throw a big bag. Okay, uh -huh. okay. Well, who's going to be there? Well, so far, you, me, and the cake. Ah. <laughs> so, it's an intimate birthday, huh? Steve is an intimate one, huh? Okay. Okay. Well, uh, I can't make it, so say hi to the cake. <laughs> understand. Myra's out of town this weekend, and I decided not to invite my parents. Well, why not? Yeah, really. Well, I'm still a little myth that they put those trick candles on my birthday cake last year. Oh, man, I used to hate those, man. I used to hate those. I feel him on this. I used to hate those. Ugh. The ones that won't blow out? No, yeah. the ones that blow up. Oh, <laughs> no, nope, never experienced that. No, no, my parents love me. My parents love me, huh? <laughs> No one's coming to your birthday party? Mm. Yeah, but that's okay. Hey, I'm Steve Urkel. I'm used to being alone. Oh. Oh. Pish times, teach. Why will just keep it on low? Observe. Oh, gosh. What's about to happen? That is a very big fan. That'd be good during the summertime. Oh. Oh. Well, there you go. There it is. There it is. <laughs> Steve, all his clothes blew up. Oh, gosh. And there it is. And there it is. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. Lost everything. Look, trying to find his glasses. Oh, goodness great. Look at Waldo. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, looking. Look at Laura. Look. <laughs> Laura, I caught you, girl. I caught you looking. Steve just got on glasses and boxers. I, look, I caught you looking, Laura. <laughs> Can I do that? Uh, yeah. Lord, you can turn away. She ain't turning away, though. Look at her. Look at her. She ain't turning away. Lord, look, look. It ain't time yet, girl. <laughs> oh, gosh. I hope you've learned your lesson. Uh-huh. <laughs> Get it, Steve. <laughs> Lord should have known. Look, Lord should have known Steve was going to try. This is a romantic setting. Steve was going to try to get his little snuggle in. You know, but Laura's like, look, uh-uh, look. No, no, we don't do that. We don't do that in public. Steve, you got to keep that in-house. That's in-house, Steve, in-house. Hello, King. Yeah, this is Laura Winslow. Mm, what you doing, Laura? Yeah, I'm having a birthday party for a friend this Saturday at my house. Aww. Can you come? Aww. Well, the party's for Steve Earl. Oh. Oh. <laughs> click him. Click, 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 click him. Oh, Lord. I love you doing this, though. No, they, they're not there. They're not there, Laura. They're not there. Uh-uh. I wanted to invite you to a birthday party for Steve. Mm. Steve? Steve Urkel? Yeah. Oh, wow. 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 <laughs> but I love that. Look at look what Laura's doing. Look at this. I love what she's doing. These boys right here. They need a, they need a spanking and a timeout. It's over here laughing. Y'all kicking it with Steve. Huh. I forgot what are we laughing about again? Nothing. Nothing. She wants to throw a birthday party for Urkel. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> wow. Wow. Look at... Now, now, look. Let's just point this out, man. Look what Laura is doing. First of all, she's trying to get this party together for Steve. You know, um, surprise party. So she's calling people. First, she gets to click them. You know what I'm saying? She get, you know, she gets clicked on. And let's just believe that that wasn't the first click them. Laura's probably heard a lot of click them. She probably got click them ringing in her ears. Click them, click them. You know, now she's asking Waldo and Weasel, you know, if they will come. And these dudes are laughing in her face. Laughing in her face. So think about the ridicule. The Lord is dealing with right now, and w as she's going beyond the call of duty, <laughs> dealing with these dudes. Stop it, you think it's not funny? Right. Oh, yeah, if it's not funny, then why are we laughing? <laughs> Get him, Lord. Get him, Lord. You guys should be ashamed of yourselves. Absolutely. Steve Urkel has been a good friend to both of you. Uh huh. He has? Right. Yes. Weasel, who brought you that nice brass plaque to commemorate your 100th day of detention? <laughs> 
Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Let them, Lord, let them know. Let the, remind them, huh? That's the art man we talking about. Look, you about to be disrespecting my friend. Come on now. Huh. Uncle. Right. I have to admit that was very thoughtful. Mm. <laughs> so when you're depressed, who cheers you up by making shadow animals? Mm. Urkel. Mm. Sometimes he even does them over the phone. <laughs> she's reminding them, you know, the value of Steve. I love that she's doing this. And she's standing up for him. Uh-huh. <laughs> well, okay then. <sighs> what do you say? Will you come to Steve's party? No. Wow. Oh my gosh. Well, why not? Straight up. Because because ain't nobody gonna be there. <laughs> Lord, just, <laughs> man, oh my gosh. This is one of those episodes that like, just, oh, it just smashed your heart. But, you know, one thing I want to point out that I kind of pointed out before that I think is actually kind of a big thing is when I point out how Lord, you know what I'm saying, was looking. Lord, when y'all 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 read your Bibles, you know, the covenant eyes. I don't know if Lord was using her covenant eyes, huh? When she was looking at Steve just in his in his in his eyeglasses and boxes, you know. But I but I really actually wonder if this is kind of slow, like a slow cooker, right? Slow cooking. But I really wonder if this is kind of the start. Uh, maybe where Laura is starting to very slowly, like I said, on the slow cooker, okay? It's her attraction to Steve is on the slow cooker, okay? It's on the slow cooker. But I wonder if this is kind of the start of it. Because if you remember in times past, Laura will see Steve kind of, you know, without a shirt on or this and that. And she kind of, if you notice, she kind of turns away, right? You even notice when he's trying to flex on her sometimes, trying to put his muscles out there. What does she do? She kind of, she kind of looks away. And this time, you know, she did not look away, like at all. You know what I'm saying? I don't even know if the girl blinked. Matter of fact, I think somebody maybe have needed to check on her. You know what I'm saying? But <laughs> I'm I'm being silly. But I really do kind of wonder if this is kind of like I said, it's on a it's on a it's on a, it's on a slow cooker that these things are starting to build. You know, more and more and more and more. You know, but just very very slowly. Slowly. Why? Because what I've said before, a lot of times things that happen organically actually happen very slowly. And that is okay. Because a lot of times those things that happen slowly and organically are usually the ones that stick around, baby. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, this is one of the things I wanted to point out, you know, um, and also that, you know, you saw Lord you say, oh, I'm, I'm used to, I'm Steve Urkel. I'm used to being alone. And Lord's like, watch this. Watch this. I'm going to show you your value. Even though I don't tell you all the time, I'm going to show you your value. Um, I'm going to change the narrative of that, you know, at least for this time. And, and I just think that is that again, I mean, shall we be impressed? Yes, we shall be impressed. But I'm just saying that's Stephen Laura. That is Steve and Laura. You know what I'm saying? They sacrifice it and, and not even a sacrifice, but it's like they go beyond you know, what is necessary and what is needed for each other. And I think it's because they don't know how to do it any other way because they're being moved and governed by their hearts. You know, so this is just a beautiful uh, little moment that they had there um, with Laura. And Laura got to figure out what to do with this party, baby, because she's getting pushed back. We're trying to get people to come to Steve's party, you know. But yeah, man, love God, love people. May God bless you. May God keep you.